Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for July 14th of 2023 well, it is titled Comet C slash 2023 E1 Atlas near Perihelion. So what do we see here? Well, this is the comet known as Atlas, and that's named after its discovery, which, or discoverer, which was the asteroid terrestrial impact last alert system. So it's not the only comet Atlas we have. Of course, there are other comets that this uh, device has been able to detect. Now here we see the image of the distinct uh, coma of the comet. Now the comet itself is just a ball of ice toward the center of this and would be completely invisible to this scale. But if we when it gets close to the sun, that material is vaporized and that forms that green coma around the nucleus of the comet. And that's what we can actually see. Now the coma is green due to carbon. So the excitation of carbon atoms from the nucleus of the comet and those then excited and glow green. Now we often see the red glow of hydrogen gas. Carbon when excited gives us a green glow such as we see here. And much as we often see the aurora glow glowing in a different shade of green when we see excitation within Earth's atmosphere. Now this was this uh, this comet approached perihelion, which would be its closest approach to the sun on July 1st. So it's now moving away from the sun, but still moving closer to Earth. So the closest approach to Earth will be on August 18th, when it will be just about a third of an astronomical unit away from Earth. Now, how far is that third of an astronomical unit? Well, one astronomical unit is about 150 million kilometers. And that means it would be about 50 million kilometers away from Earth. In miles, that would be more like 30 million or so. So it's still going to be far, far away from Earth. So even though it's making its closest approach, it's not coming anywhere near Earth and will not, is in no danger of any kind of impact. Now, this is actually a comet much like another very famous comet. It's a Halley type comet and it has an orbital period very close to that of Halley's Comet. Halley's Comet has a orbital period of about 76 years. This one's a little bit longer. It comes back about every 85 years. So it's actually made previous vis visits into the inner solar system. But they may not have been detected because it is not an extremely bright comet. So and, if, and depending on the positioning when it came in previously, we may not have easily detected it 85 years ago when it last came in. But based on its orbital characteristics, it is similar to the type of comet that it, we know as the famous Halley's Comet. So that was our picture of the day for July 14th of 2023. It was titled Comet C slash 2023 E1 Atlas near Perihelion. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.